the universe of XS. You're about to experience the latest scientific wonder brought to you by XS Tech, the galaxy's leader in innovative high technology. But first, let me share with you the fascinating story of our company. We began many galactic years ago on a world quite distant from your own. From one small manufacturing plant, we've grown into the largest consumer-oriented research and development company in the universe. Excess Tech is number one in electro-robotics, cryo-cybernetics, techno-surveillance, planetary restructuring, genetic engineering, and hyperspatial transport. Here at Excess, helping others seize the future has always been our goal. It's a tradition handed down from our founders and carried on by current chairman, L.C. Clench. We were, of course, extremely enthused when our market research probe discovered the Earth. A world with so many eager customers is always worth our greatest effort. And for today's demonstration, thousands of skilled excess engineers have worked around the clock. We think you'll find our hard work well worth your while. After all, if something can't be done with excess, then it shouldn't be done at all. Now, I know some critics have implied that we are interested in the Earth solely for commercial reasons, for profit. But I believe we have an important obligation to help less fortunate planets upgrade their technologies. Profit is simply a byproduct we've learned to live with. So join with me now, won't you? And together we will seize the future with access. Ladies and gentlemen, in just a few moments, the automatic doors will open. <laughs> And now, to tell you more about living life with excess, here once again is Chairman Clench. What? By now, you must be wondering how excess tech can help you seize the future. Well, wonder no more. Here to show you how is our most advanced cyberbotic performance unit to date. Ah, welcome, weary travelers, to the great big universe of XS. You may call me Sir, that is S I R, which stands for Simulated Intelligence Robotics. What do you want, Skippy? No, you may not get out. You're a lucky volunteer. Now, dear friends, you're probably asking, what could the galaxy's leader in sophisticated technology possibly do for me? Well, how would you like to travel anywhere, anytime, at the touch of a button? Science fiction? No. Behold, the XS Series 1000. The first in a complete line of personal and commercial teleportation systems capable of sending bright-eyed biological life forms like yourselves and even lower life forms like Skippy from one place to another instantly. In a moment, I will break down our fuzzy little friend into a mass of molecules. Send those molecules through the air above your head and reconstruct them in the tube over here as good as new. And now, witness for yourselves the wonders of XS teleportation. Phase one of the process has begun. Disintegration into molecular components. Don't worry, it's practically painless. And now the second phase. The molecules are beamed to the receiving chamber where atom by atom we reconstruct our carefree travel. Here's the little skipper now. Oh, shut up, Scruffy. You're not burned. You've just got a healthy glow. Oh. Skippy, you 
You just reminded me of a feature that I absolutely love. With the mere touch of a button, the entire process can be reversed. Bon voyage! And this is my favorite. It can be suspended. Indefinitely. My dear friends, you've just witnessed a small sample of the awesome power of excess teleportation. But wait, there's much more. Imagine if the trip were not merely the width of this room, but the breadth of a galaxy, the span of a universe. Well, imagine no more. Because soon one of you will be taking that trip. One of you will seize the future with excess. Attention visitors, please gather your belongings, including smaller carbon-based life forms, and proceed to your right into our testing chamber. There you go. all the way to the end of that road. Remember, the future waits for no one, not even you. <laughs> Attention Earthlings, for the success of our demonstration, we insist you remain upright. Keep your arms by your side, with your feet firmly planted on the floor. Excess regulations require all life forms be properly seated, or the demonstration will be terminated. Thank you for your submission. Look, our other transmissions did not cover this kind of distance. Again, you are putting sales before science. Exactly. Someone's got to be a role model. What? Ah! People of Earth. Greetings to each and every one of you. I'm Spinlock, XS Management Supervisor, speaking to you live from across the galaxy, where we're all set for yet another spectacular demonstration. Dr. Venus? Hello. Look, I don't think we should... We should waste another moment. I couldn't agree with you more. Ready when you are, Dr. Venus. Thank you. The analysis modules above your head will now lower into place. Please remain seated in an upright position with your arms at your sides. When the modules touch your shoulders, they will stop automatically, so remain seated and do not interrupt their operation. I trust you were all impressed with our earlier demonstration in which a living creature was teleported a short distance in total comfort. Now the time has come for one of you to experience something much more remarkable. A journey through interstellar space via XS teleportation. Dr. Phoenix will now analyze your human physiology to determine which one of you is suitable for our demonstration. Deadlink online, analyzing now. Boost the IQ, there's a lot of genetics. And we've got our lucky traveler to whisk across the galaxy. In just a moment, the analysis module will rise. Please stand aside. I'm Spock. Chairman Glenn. So, is everything on schedule? Well, to tell you the truth, We're ahead of schedule. Excellent. Just selected a volunteer. It's off. Oh, good. I've been seized. Something you mentioned? Seized with inspiration. A new idea. Oh, terrific. We're live, right? Yes, very. Hello, everyone. I've recalculated our plan. You see, if if we bring one of you here, well, I just get to meet one of you. However, if I'm teleported to Earth, I can meet all of you. Shake each hand and personally answer all your questions about the wonders of excess. I'll be with you in just a moment. Prepare yourselves for an unforgettable encounter. <laughs> Feeble mind, but the only way to seize the future is to grasp the present. That's the present. Yes, well, the chairman certainly has a way with words. What do you say, Dr. Peters? Shall we grasp? Yeah, grasp, right. But first, I have to totally recalibrate. Seize! Yeah. Okay, Doctor. I am going as fast as I can. Yes, Dr. Peters. Ah. I do everything. No, no. It must have intercepted the signal. What? But wait, wait, I've got something. Could you boost the power and send it to Earth? Well, what if it's not him? Of course it's him. Send him to Earth! 
floating lines, including those smaller biological life forms, and move directly to the exit doorway. <laughs>